here for it. It's like I'm an old and arthritical. <laughs> it's fall! There, get me more caterpillars. Need ten. God! What the heck? Where's your mama? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Too soon. <laughs> See, fall is the best... Best season. Best season. Yeah. Did oh I get called goodness. out for something too soon yesterday? I cannot remember. Huh? Yeah, I did. Never mind. <laughs> Me and my death jokes. Oh, uh, I got, who yeah. was it? <laughs> um, Willy Wonka, man. Yeah. What's, I don't remember. I can't remember name. the dude's name. Gene Wilder. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. That is name. Nice yep. going for someone who's never seen it. I'm sure I've seen I've seen bits and pieces. I watched Bruce Almighty today. Yeah, it, I'm not a fan. Really? Yeah, it's all right, but Did you watch the whole thing. Yeah, except for like pretty the first ten minutes. Yeah, and I watched part of Liar Liar. See, I like Bruce Almighty way better than Liar Liar. Yeah, I did. I wasn't. A fan See, everyone of loves Liar Liar. I'm not the really? biggest fan of it. Yeah, it's one of his most famous movies. Really? Yeah. It's okay. Have you seen Fun with Dick and James? No. Nope. That one's really funny. I like Dumb and Dumber. Yeah. Yeah, so because I opened up his house, he gives me a... He's been waiting months to give me this. So, like, time is actually passing, so it's cool. That's neat. Yeah. That's a guy you don't see in very many movies. Yeah, Jim Carrey. He's in hardly anything anymore. Yeah. yeah. He's directing or writing some new show. Him and, uh... Ah, oh, what's oh my gosh! Some other famous, um, funny lady. Awesome. Yeah, they're they're doing the new show. Have you seen a picture of him and his beard? No. no. Oh my gosh! I'll look this up for you. <laughs> like a I'll uh, I'll put it on the screen too. Head. A what? No, 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 no. <laughs> Let me pull this up. It's pretty epic. He looks. He looks. Not super old, but he looks pretty old. Okay. Hey, he's old. Uh, look at Tim. He's, 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 he's in his 50s. Mid 50s, yeah. uh, That's super old. Seth <laughs> <That's> Josh. <laughs> <laughs> How old is Josh? Josh is not. Okay. Josh is like 80. Uh, 80, that's right. That's right. <laughs> oh, yeah. So the camel gets sassy now. Really? It's 55. He's not that old, he is. Let me get to that picture now. So this is a reference to the second game that didn't exist yet. Oh, that's cool. Um, well, hang on. Um, I'm off to the lava world. And then you find him locked up in a cage bef in a different level when he's trying to get to the lava world. So he never actually made it. But once you free him, you actually do find him in the lava world. Oh, nice. Yeah. In the second one, does he make a reference to? Whoa! Does he make a reference to? Uh, um, That's weird. Banjo three? No. Yeah. He <laughs> looks kind of like Robin Williams, right there. A little bit. That's a guy I miss. Yep. Oh, Robin. He was funny. Oh, awesome! I did this cool platforming, and it doesn't even matter. Can't. Oh yeah, you gotta be the beat. Yeah, you gotta climb it. Yeah. Well, you gotta fly. Yeah. I like all these leaf piles. Have you ever seen The Mask? Yeah. The first one. Yeah. first one's really good. Yeah, the second one just... Oof. Me and Caleb started to watch that one. We're like, this is terrible. I'm going to shoot myself in the leg to watch the second one again. Are you sure? That's, yeah, that's it's like the kid mask, isn't it, or something? Uh, Son of the Mask. It's garbage. It's yeah. not him. Yeah. And it's just weird. It's not good. Have you ever been shot, Justin? No, but I would take it for that movie. I'll hold you to that. Um, <laughs> Come on. If not that movie, um, what are those anime movies? Um, shoot. The Great Outdoors. Those sequels are garbage. Really? Oh, yeah. Have you ever seen The Great Outdoors? Is it The Great Outdoors? That the one it has like the far? bear. It's about the bear and uh, like the, the one antler deer. Elliot. Open Season? Open Season. Have you ever watched Open Season? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Have you ever seen the sequels? Some? Yeah. Those are bad. I saw the second one. Second one's bad and third one. Second one, it. 
I don't like it very much, but I can watch it. I can't watch it. I don't think the I, first one was all that great, was it? It was funny. It was a lot. It's like it's like one of these cheapo sequels they push out really soon. Yep. It was shockingly bad compared to the first. And yeah. the third, they just like gave up. They were on cocaine or something. Yeah, the, f- uh, the third one's awesome. awful. Stupid wiener dog was like playing with like the stress balls. Yeah! After he just got neutered. It was the poodle, yeah. So weird. That was hilarious. That was not... That, that, that's the best part of the movie. It's one of the... Oh my gosh. But it was funny. (laughs) I hate that movie. (laughs) First one, I I like fun. Yeah. Sequels of garbage. Yeah. Ugh. I feel that way with Despicable Me. crap bird. (laughs) See, I don't think they're garbage. Well, I... I... Did not think that they needed a sequel at all. Like, see, I like the sequel. Really? I like the first. Okay, I think they actually go in order. Like, I just, I just got through watching the third one a few days ago. Oh, you watched it? Yeah. Huh. That one, the best part is what they show in the commercials. Yeah. So, like, when the bad guy comes out, he's doing like his eighties dance and yeah. stuff. Yeah. Oh, you saw? The th- Sorry, I was totally zoned out. Yeah, I, mean, I went with mom to watch it. Oh, nice. Cool. Um. So that's the best part. There's more to it a little bit. So, yeah. like, the first five, ten minutes is, like, the best part of the movie. Nice. It's not that the movie's bad. Mm-hmm. It's just they made, like, almost too goofy. Oh, yeah. Like, Gru and his brother. Mm-hmm. And, yeah. Which I know the first one was goofy with him, but it was just a little overdone to me. Right. So I think, in my opinion, it goes one, two, then three, probably. Yeah. Even though the bad guy in three was awesome. <laughs> he was hilarious. Who, Josh? Yeah, basically <laughs> it's just Josh with a mustache. <laughs> Shout out to our friend Josh. That's yeah. Basically, the speak only three, three character. Yeah. Which I can't think of that guy's name. Is it like Billy? Oh my gosh. Oh. Is it like Ray? Uh, or Cyrus? <laughs> no. <laughs> It'd be really fun if the camera would not invert when I get Woof. against geometry. <laughs> That'd be tight. Woo! Oh, what's oh. up? You bees can't catch a bird. You fools. It'd be cool if you could just eat the bees. Just like, yeah, I mean, it's a bird. Yeah. <laughs> bird type. <laughs> bird eats bug. Or uh, flying. Yeah. Bird type. <laughs> yeah. Mm. It's basically bird type. Yeah. Oh, nice. Justin, I'm, ple- I'm a professional gamer, guys. I forgot. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Where was I saying that the other night? You're playing Zelda. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Have you ever come across a Lionel that has a spear? A spear? Yep. Yeah, I really like those. I actually. hate fighting those. I don't know if I have or not. Oh, I just like having the spear. Have you ever came across one that has a mace? Like a giant club? I think so. Yeah. Those, those are fun to fight. Those are my favorite to fight. Yeah, because I think I've gotten their weapons before. Yeah. The ones with the spear, I can't do the, the witch time at all. <laughs> What? The it's a bang the flurry bang. attack, the fury attack. I mean, where you like dodge? Oh, where you dodge? Yeah. yeah. I can't. Mode. The only one I can do it is when he charges at me. Really? Yeah. Man, I remember the one with the flame sword that was like rip frame rate. Yep. And it's so funny because I saw a gameplay of that same type again, mm-hmm. and that frame rate wasn't crap in the bed. I don't know if it was because it was in the planes or what, but like. Ugh, that was rough. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't actually fix that. They fixed a lot in that game so mm-hmm. far. It, They've just done some nice quality patches. It helps a lot if you're playing it handheld mode. Which is weird. That's so it's cause weird. because the resolution yeah. is a dip, I'm assuming. But like, I have noticed not well, hardly it, any It goes problems. to 720p in yeah. handheld and right. 1080 in the screen. Yeah. In the TV, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> I know y'all use it a lot of handheld, but I like never use it handheld yeah. hardly. Dude, I took it to Dallas with me. I had it open for like five minutes. I was like, no. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I've, whenever I took my Switch over to Michael's, I haven't put the dock up uh, or unpacked it, so I've just been playing it off. I actually haven't played it in a while. I yeah. want to get back into Cave Store. I haven't really touched that thing. Yeah, it's a good game. You can beat it in like five hours. It's short. Well, to get the true ending, uh, 
you'll never get it on your first playthrough, but... Oh, uh, no. Well, yeah, I like, the manual in it tells you how to get the secret ending, but it tells you, like, do not read any farther if you wanted to do this by yourself. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they really? They said we suggest doing it the way it was intended. Huh. And, um... But I went back and read it after I beat it, and I was like, dang, I should have just read it. <laughs> yeah. Because you got to play through the whole game again to get the secret ending. Based, yeah, yeah, you do have to play through the whole game again to get the secret ending. Huh. Isn't it hard? That's yeah, pretty hard. One boss is kicking my booty all day. No, to get the ending. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. I thought you said Jay Woods just gave up. Maybe, I don't, I don't know. I don't know Jay Woods' life. That's what you said. B, I don't know your life. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, did you listen to the new Cox and Kendor? I think so. Oh my goodness. <sighs> what were they talking about in that one? Uh, whenever he was at, um, I wonder if it was Hot Topic where he was at, but the woman was just like, and your, your cashier, she looks like a boy, and she like runs off and starts crying. <laughs> what? <laughs> Maybe I didn't hear that one. Uh, that, that was Space Now. Oh, uh, that one was funny. Uh oh, you're in the thorns. Yes, Austin, I'm aware. Bam. I'm the master of the video. Yeah, apparently. I hate this power up. <laughs> it takes so long. Okay, it's pretty good walking speed, honestly. <clears throat> I'm telling you, I was super salty when I found that Namco museum was not physical. Yeah. After I drove to Best Buy. Looked for it. And it's dumb how hard it is to look stuff up on the internet sometimes. Trying yeah. to find out there's a physical release and you're just like barely getting any information. As the game is already out. <laughs> yep. Oh, I'm an idiot. You can go on those fly traps as the bee and they don't attack you. Hmm. Should have just done that. When does Minecraft come to physical? If it does. It may not, I mean. Oh. Is Shovel Knight getting one? Oh! No. oh. Ouch! On that note, we'll be back. I know, but yeah. like... We'll be back in black. Can't go back. What? Won't go back. Let's do this! Yeah! So stupid, like, I hit that bird and it was like, no you didn't. Sorry. Yes, eerie. Oh god. I'm gonna get more. Is it eerie or eyrie? Well, it might be eyrie, actually. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's eerie. I like how this whole playthrough we're like, we don't need to collect those golden feathers now. We actually need them. Well, it's cause just cause I ran out. Well, yeah. But you have to collect those again. Yeah. But the um the notes I collected stay. If this was the N64 right. version, they didn't. I would have right. to go back through every single one and recollect all my notes. Birds suck. Why did it like do a cutscene? I don't know. That was weird. Yo, what's up? Hi, I'm Benjo. How are you doing? Stop. So, what's each of y'all's favorite like 3D platformer game like this from this era? It's like uh, Mario 64. Yeah, from this area, Mario 64. Like hand, hands down, no yeah. question. Donkey Kong 64 for me. Yeah. Nice. This one's close to Mario 64, but, like, no. Nah. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't sure if you were going to say this or 64 Mario or whatever. I don't know why I said that bad. Yeah, no, that's fine. 64, 64 Mario, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 64 Mario, yeah. Mario 128, yeah. <laughs> Plays it. 64 Mario Super Time, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 420. Yeah. Every day. Hey, where were all the worms? I don't know. I don't know, man. <sighs> this is your game, man. I know. This is your man child. Like, this is the stupidest ever. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> weird. You're weird. Just oh, you can just jump out of the roll? That's weird. Oh. It'd be nice if I could rotate the camera. There's one. 64. There's one behind you. No, there's not. Look. Go back up there. I could have sworn I saw one. No, you didn't. It's that dude's hat. It's no. the same color. I got this one. Look look on the ground over there. Okay, maybe that was it. It's a bee, Austin. I don't know. 
I like the uh, are that. floating around in the air. Yeah, it's a nice effect. You know, that's one thing I haven't seen much of this year is bees. I wonder why. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen a lot of wasps. Too many. I got what? What's killing the bees again? I don't know. Uh -huh. They're just babies? Is that what it is? Apparently. They're just not tough enough to make it? You need to take I mean, some lessons from spiders, I guess. I'm not sure if it's like us and the whole environment stuff, if it actually is us this time. Mm -hmm. Or what? I don't know, but you need bees. Yeah, yeah. Like, that's kind of important. Yeah, bees are bees are life. Like this camel, literally. There's one. I saw it. <laughs> Ew! Put that away, sir. The camel's like, I'm done with this. Wonder if people are like, lava world. There's another freaking world. <laughs> have much of an attachment to the 64. Like, I like it, but it's no GameCube. It's funny, for as much as I do like it, mm -hmm. I hardly ever play it. Like, I think it's the games, I'm kind of like, I yeah. don't know. I don't know what my deal is. I need to play Mega Man 64. I own it. I just haven't done it. You own it? Yeah. Oh. I thought it was better on the PlayStation. Uh, I got some games I've never actually played on there. I'm working at right now. Oh yeah. Uh, I've never touched my Diddy Kong Racing. That game is so tight. Yeah, that'd be fun. Diddy one Kong to do. Racing is awesome. How long does it take to beat that game? Not long. We should do that on here sometime. It's about like. Actually, it's pretty. It's, it's got stuff to it. I actually don't know how long it is, but it's tight. You should play Diddy Kong Racing. Got that. We need to play WrestleMania 2000. I we need to play the new one. <laughs> That one's supposed to be uh, really good, dude. Oh, uh, it's really? Yeah. Yeah. And you can make your own characters and crypt. Yo, 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 we're not getting any more notes of the whole game. <laughs> Just kidding. We're not. We are getting more notes. Uh, <laughs> Wave Race. I played that before. I never played it. It's really Isn't the one on the GameCube supposed to be really good, too? Yeah. I have. I actually never played it either. Let's see. It's common theme around here. I just put my shorts on. It's getting hot. Wave lace, wave race, wave lace, wave, wave lace. Oh, the one we're gonna have to do at least a one-off video on is uh, Beetle Racing Adventure. That game uh, is good, actually. That game is so. Weird. It's really fun. It's a good handling racing. Game. It's hard, but it's yeah. it's fun. <laughs> Remember when we got the sixty-four? We borrowed your Spider-Man and the Beetle Racing. I didn't. I, y'all. I didn't know y'all borrowed Beetle Racing. It's yep. Fun. That's the only time I played it. Yep. <laughs> it's funny, uh, that Dad actually got that game from Mom. <laughs> That's awesome. Back, I think we we might have been, lived in Bentonville still. Wow. So, like 18 years ago. Did you hear how much freaking money Walmart spent on property in Bentonville? It's a whole lot. Dude. They own a lot of Bentonville so Well, they they they'd been going through and buying some more, oh, and really? there was a. There was a half acre house, a, a 2,000 foot square foot house on half an acre, and they paid <laughs> almost $400,000 for it. Where I used to live in Bentonville, hmm? that lot sold a couple years ago for 250000 And what they did, they bought that property, and mm -hmm. they knocked down my old house. Nice. Yeah. yeah, Walmart just wants the land. Well, I don't know if Walmart bought it, this one or not. They may have. I don't know who bought it, but mm. it's kind of sad. But it's pretty impressive. I think Dad's, they sold that land for like the land in the house for like fifty or sixty thousand, and now it's selling for two hundred fifty thousand. If he only knew. Yeah, of course. That was like I don't know how the neighborhood is now. That was a really bad neighborhood then. Yeah, hindsight's twenty twenty. There was a uh, drug dealers live across the road. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, there's drug dealers in Garfield. Yeah, and I think. And users. <laughs> That's close to where that uh, Justin kid lived that killed his dad. Oh, he went... Yeah. I'm not going to extrapolate on that, but we knew him. Yeah. <laughs> really? I think yeah. he lived on that same road or right there. Oh, cool. So, right. yeah, it was a great area. Yeah. A little shady. I mean, I guess it wasn't the area's fault that that kid killed his Do dad. you have to get inside? No, it's just that it was between that and the drug dealers. And it was just... Yeah. At the time. 
That area, like, Bentonville Square area, that's gotten so popular and, like... Hate going there. Like, they, yeah. like, ramped it up so much. I hate trying to go there because all the pedestrian traffic, it's like, you can't move. I really like that area, but... You seem to be fine with crowds. I, uh, I can deal with crowds. I don't like crowds. I'm not a fan. Man, I don't like to seek out crowds to stay in them, but like... like if I was a violent <laughs> person, I'd end up like hitting people. What? <laughs> what? Just see you searching out crowds. Yeah, like, just hey, fellas, where are we going? <laughs> crowd gets a little too small. I yeah. guess we're moving on. All right, we'll see you later. Man, you need to go to flip a NASCAR race on the, the, the big race day, Monster Energy. Good gosh, there's yeah. a lot of people walking around. Oh, yeah. And then uh, there's been a few times we've gone to see Kyle on race day where he's doing an appearance and he'd be like on the other side of the track and you're trying to make their in time to see it. Yeah. So many people. I bet. You're weaving in and out of traffic. Yep. See, that's it. another thing. It's like if we go to that baseball game, traffic's going to be awful. Maybe. 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 Well, we don't know that area. How I thought that was the case. Yeah, well. that's true. Hi there, Hi there everybody. I need six more acorns. Flipping that Rascal Flats concert I went to the other day at the Amp. Mm -hmm. That wasn't too bad, actually, getting out of there. Really? That was pretty impressive. I thought we were going to get there for a bit, but we really didn't. Yeah. Is there a Rascal Sharps? No. <laughs> oh, fuck. Scott coming down from Dallas to come down here for a week. Right. He came down the same night and went to that concert. And I guess, like, the Rascal Flats uh, um, big rig pulled out right in front of him. Well, him. That's he awesome. Him? I don't think he like. I don't know if he hates them, but he doesn't like them. Huh. Be Would that have been a little awkward if my favorite group killed him? Oh, <laughs> 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 uh, uh, that would be bad. <laughs> That'd be really bad. But, um, I don't know if I can listen to this now. <laughs> What's this? Nutter? What's his name? Um, it's not Nutter. Nut uh, Nutless. Nutless. It's not yeah, it's not. <laughs> Nutter, you stupid me. You had a corn in here the whole time. <laughs> Natalia, put it back. Freaking love that. That's such a Dang game. it! I just wasted a golden feather for no raisin. No raisins? Yeah. I hate raisins. Dude, raisins are pretty good. Actually. No, they're not. They're not bad. I can just munch they're... them. Like, I don't seek out raisins. But yeah, I don't either. I'll raisin watch. cookies don't like that bullcrap. I seek out raisins but to destroy I've them. I've never had raisin cookies in my life. Really? Yeah. I guess I've just gotten oh, lucky. Oh, yeah, you have gotten lucky. It's bad whenever you think it's chocolate chip and you bite into yeah. it and you're like, what is this? Oh, it's so poison? it's so jarring when it's not chocolate yeah. chip and it's freaking raisin. Airy, how's it going, buddy? It might be Airy. I, I, now you're throwing me off. <laughs> I, it's probably <coughs> eerie. It's eerie because like the dragon eerie in Dark Souls 2 is spelled like that, I thought. Uh. <gasps> Shadow is watching. <laughs> Come on. Oh, it's as simple as that, ladies and gentlemen, when you're a pro gamer. How's it going? Hi, guys. Welcome <laughs> back to the, uh, uh, what's it called? Red Bull uh, Major Kazooie speedrun. Um. <laughs> this is a speedrun we're doing for. Brought to you by Red Bull. Did I mention Red Bull? The Red Bull Cup? <laughs> Dude, I saw on Twitter, um, they were talking about how like little some of these pro gamers make. Yeah. And some of the... Gamers, professional gamers. Yeah. Gamers. <laughs> um, and I guess certain game series, oh, they yeah. should Smash, make a lot of money. Smash, you don't make much. So, but they were saying, I guess, pro gamers that work for, I think it's Activision? Uh -huh. They make minimum 50000 a year plus benefits. Dang. So, like... I could do that. Are those I mean, if I was those, good at games, but are they the like fake shoutcasters for the commercials, where it's like they have Nabnut. Okay, yeah. Where it's like, have you have you seen that? They did it at E3 again, where they have like pre-recorded um, uh, commentary, like like competitive commentary over a trailer, and it's the weirdest thing. I don't ever. know. Okay. It just said pro gamers. That work for Activision, so I don't know. Games. <laughs> Sorry, this is funny to me. <laughs> It'd be nice to make 50000 just play games. That'd yeah. be awesome. I don't know, I already do. Like, well, I don't know, guys, I'm a first-time gamer. So you're holding out most of them. 
Yeah, you don't make much in Smash because it's not, like, supported very much by Nintendo. And, like, a lot of it is the Melee fan base who are a bunch of crybabies. That, like, why would Nintendo support a 16-year-old game? Like, yep. Yeah. Makes no sense. And then Pokemon, you don't make a lot of money. You can make decent money, like, because there's, there's actual sanctioned things by the Pokemon company, but, um, yeah. I don't know. I think the I think the money money is in like Dota and those types of games, like League. Not probably not League, but yeah, not those, League. those types of games. The can ones you, that are big in. Can you make Dota money at the or, yeah. when Capcom does a deal for Street Fighter? Evo, the Capcom Cup. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't the pot like two million? I don't know. It's high. Yeah. But you gotta be the very very best to do that. Yeah. It's like I can't think of a game I would want to try to even try. Be like a pro at. I don't know. Uh, if I didn't have to have a job, I'd probably practice Smash and Pokemon. That'd be my two. Cause like I'm competent in both, but I'm not like phenom I'm not tournament level in either. Yeah, I'm not saying I'm tournament level at all in this, but the first thing that comes to mind is just be a shooter type game. Yeah. Yeah. Cause I do enjoy that, and I think that's something I could actually adapt to. But yeah. See, I couldn't. Uh, I, I get pretty good at them when I practice, but I just, like, I, I don't want to be good, <laughs> like, yeah. that good at them. Uh, who did I, who did I have left? Nabnut needs more nuts, right? Yeah. Can I bring him to him by winter, or does it have to be in this zone? Probably this zone. I don't think so, because there's not a flight pad. And I know to get some of the acorns, you got to have a flight pad. Yeah. We'll find the rest of his nuts in the next episode. Yeah.